how much momentum will a dumbbell of mass 10 kg transfer to the floor if it falls from a height of 80 cm and does not rebound take its downward acceleration to be 10 m per second square here this is the dumbbell this is the floor okay this is 80 cm that is it falls from a height of 80 cm and this is of mass 10 kg and does not rebound take its downward acceleration to be 10 m per second square we can write down the given data mass equal to 10 kg next acceleration is also given acceleration equal to 10 meter per second square and the distance is distance equal to 80 centimeter you can convert it into meter by 80 by 100 meter equal to 0 0.8 meter since we drop the dumbbell the initial velocity u equal to 0 that is since we drop the dumbbell dumbbell initial velocity will be 0 initial velocity u equal to 0 meter per second and final velocity equal to question mark that is v now we know momentum equal to mass into velocity that is momentum p is equal to m into v okay In order to find out the momentum, we need V. So, we need to find out the final velocity. We have U, A and S distances S. So, from this we can use the third equation of motion. third equation of motion v square minus u square is equal to 2 as this v square minus 0 is equal to 2 into 10 into 0 0.8 that is v square is equal to 16 this v is equal to root of plus or minus root of 16 that is plus or minus 4 meter per second since the acceleration is positive velocity increases okay velocity increases so we take the positive value of v so v is equal to 4 meter per second then we know momentum is equal to mass into velocity we got the velocity final velocity as 4 meter per second so mass that is 10 kilogram into 4 meter per second that is 40 kilogram meter per second is the momentum here the given data first of all we need to write down the given data that is mass equal to 10 kg acceleration is equal to 10 meter per second square and distance equal to 80 centimeter these are the given data from this we will find out the momentum but in order to find out the momentum we need the final velocity so we are using v square minus u square is equal to 2as we know what is u what is a and what is s it is given in the question so using this we will find out the v 
okay then we will take the positive value of v that is plus 4 because the acceleration is positive here so the velocity will increase so we are taking the velocity as plus then we will find out the momentum that is mass into velocity we know what is mass and now we know what is the velocity so we will find out this using m into v then we will get the momentum as 40 kilogram meter per second that's all thank you